Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys. Wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel where we are family, of course, with my beautiful new Bitcoin cap. You like it? Vintage. <laughs> guys, very short TA video because it's Saturday. I'm not going to spend all morning in making a video and I need to pick up my brother from the airport because he's coming to visit me for a week. Very short TA video on my views on the market at this moment. Let's jump quickly into the chart. Bam. Okay, guys, this is the four hour chart like you used. If we draw the Fibonacci retracement levels on the four hour chart, we get this chart. And we can see that we are finding support now at the 0.618 level. Um, yes, we could fall back to that level of 0.5 over there, which is around 41,000 US dollar. Uh, but then we first need to break the 45K level at the moment. And for me, this is not happening for me we are going to go up <clears throat> to this line coming down and going up and trying to break that and if we can't break it i think then we will go down before um, we go up again something like that pattern uh, sideways before we break the next two levels um, it's not going to take like till october but just to give you an idea what i expect of the market at the moment um, beautiful levels uh, these fibonacci levels please do some research on these levels uh, because it's very uh, it's just a very nice tool to understand and these levels are very cool to understand why we pull back always to certain levels in the fibonacci retracement levels oh, levels 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 guys uh, let's jump quickly into the next chart bam this one this is the day chart a yellow and a green line i just like the haggy colors um the shorts and the longs by the way this is all the bam bam indicator um combined with these hills and these sandy and beaches and combined with this it's like a triple indicator you get um like you can see it works also on a daily um just to give the idea when you just use the flags and nothing else and you buy here and you sell there not even leverage just spot trading and you buy here and you sell there and you buy here and you sell there and you buy here and you sell there and you buy here etc 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 you would already be making profit without leverage you can use leverage but without leverage um, just using the flags on the daily is working so why is this green and the yellow line there okay i will show you this green line if i click it you can see it it's the 21 ema exponential moving average on the weekly time frame the yellow line is the 21 ma on the weekly so these are on the weekly time frame um why on the weekly yeah because if you look at the weekly, it gives you a bigger prospect, uh, view. And we can even change the chart to the weekly as well to give you a better view of it, yes. Also the BAM and the weekly is usable. But why do I want to look at this one? Because I just saw the EMA crossing the MA. The green line crossing the yellow line over there. And is this important i do think this is important because if we're going to look back in history and that's what we always do when we do ta you just look at the past you look to the left on the charts then every time when the green line is above the yellow line we are pretty bullish look the moments the green line goes down below the yellow line over here wait i will put uh, these flags it's more clear the green line below the yellow line we go bearish above it we go bullish below it we go bearish above it we go bullish so as long as we look back if we go down below it we go bearish you can see this we go above it we go bullish and we can look back a long 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 time but this is like always when this green line is on top we are bullish you need to zoom in to see it very clear but you get the picture 
And now this green line was on top the last couple of months. Now went down, we went bearish, but it just crossed that yellow line again. So the EMA is crossing the MA. So in my opinion, on the long term, this is very bullish. We are going to go up. Next chart, taking too long, bam, over here, this one. If we look at the day chart, <coughs> this is the day chart on the BLX, why wouldn't we now be in the fifth wave of the Elliott wave? We have the first wave, second, third is always the longest, fourth, and then the fifth is shorter than the third. We could end at 125,000 if we would follow this parabolic growth curve. Really awesome. This is, I think, yeah, the 11th of December. So the end of December, that fifth wave could end if we go less steep. If we go less steep, guys, it could end in January. That is how the fifth wave theory of the Elliott wave should be working. Hope that is all clear. Guys, bam, if you want to trade all of that, please use the links down below the YouTube videos. Here, Femix, you get a shit load of bonus. Prime XPT, a 50% bonus. Bybit, I think almost 3,600 bonus at the moment. All kinds of bonuses. If you want to trade on the Oryx platform and use it, click on this link and use it. The Bam Bam indicator and all the other indicators will be available on this platform. Other links as well, guys. Um, that was it for today. It was a very short video. Uh, I don't want to spend too much time today because I need to prepare some stuff before I pick up my brother. So I hope you really enjoyed this short update Saturday video. I will do a live later today. Um, I think in an hour or one and a half hours, somewhere like that, I will do a live. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment as I love to respond to your comments. Thanks for watching. Always remember, we are family. Thanks. See you later today or tomorrow again. Bam!